hello and welcome back to Sundays with Angel and uh, I'd like to introduce you to someone. It's me, the <laughs> YouTube video virgin. <laughs> this is the reason why I haven't been on YouTube. Bless him. Oh. So I thought I'd say hello, drop into uh, Sundays with Angel. Oh and he's, uh, he's moved in. I have yeah. moved in. After uh, yeah I've been here now for nearly two months I think actually and it's going well. Come really quick, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Seems like a lifetime. Yeah. But um, you're the reason why this uh, episode is named The Stephen Beauty. You know why as well, don't you? I do know why. I yeah, do know why. You have seen it. I have. Shall we show them? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's me not being very proud of myself. But you'll see why in a minute. So. Okay, so in true form of play school, let's look through the square window. So, what do you think about that? Oh uh, yeah, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> so bad, isn't it? Yeah, um, I, do, I do snore uh, quite loudly, which is I don't feel very proud of, to be honest. Uh, I did. I didn't snore before uh, before we lived together, which is really it's my fault. Strange. I make him snore, apparently, allegedly. Yeah. It's my fault, isn't it? You're the sleeping beauty. Now, are you going to tell them what you're going to be doing? What you're going to be up to? Because you're, um, you're going to be doing your own set of clips and videos, aren't you? Eventually. Eventually. Yeah. We're starting up today. Yeah, we're starting today. Shall we give them yeah. a sneak peek of that later? Perhaps. Perhaps. Yeah. Okay. We'll see. Anyway, um, the sleeping beauty. Now, let me tell you about the sleeping beauty. Well, obviously, everybody knows that sleeping beauty was um, was a Disney film. Which we have here, the new Blu-ray version, I have to say very good. Um, and you know how much I like Disney? Well, I have a friend, and I, you've actually heard of him, haven't you? My um, my friend Gary, who is... Uh, oh, the dancer. Yeah, the dancer, okay, yeah. the choreographer. Okay. He told me about... Um, he said, yeah, you know what you would like? And I said, what would I like? He said, well, you know you like fairy tales and stuff. He said, have you read the series of Sleeping Beauty, the trilogy of Sleeping Beauty, as written by the lovely author Anne Rice, which obviously you know best as the... Interview with the Vampire, Vampire yeah. Lestat. There we go. So Vampire Chronicles. And of course, you really like all that. I mean, I told you about it, didn't I? Mm -hmm. So anyway, I thought, well, what a good idea. Now, um, we had a book group at work. Now, you must remember that I do work for a big uh, blue chip corporation. And we had a book group 
and uh, I suggested to the book group that um, that we read this trilogy that uh, my friend had suggested. Of course, we have it beautifully here. The first one. Yes, this is the claiming of sleeping beauty. Then goes into beauty's punishment, and then um, beauty's release. As written by Anne Rice. Now, those of you who have read it are probably giggling and laughing, but uh, obviously I hadn't read it, so I thought it'd be really nice for the book group to read. Um, it's supposed to be, it's the story of what happens once the prince kisses Sleeping Beauty and what happens afterwards. And I thought, what a great story. And Anne Rice, she's like a really good author. And I've read some of her books. Mm -hmm. um, it's not like that these are a little different to say uh, <laughs> say the least they're rather saucy rather uh, saucy it's, <laughs> it's a story of sadomasochism um, yes have it, you read all of them? I've read the first one that was okay, enough right. that was enough <laughs> 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 but, but the thing was the worst thing was that I was so mortified when I started reading it because it's about how he captures her and makes her he's slave but he's sex slave and excites her and makes her really horny and brings her to climax and it's very very graphic it's apparently it's a bit like what's that that what's that thing about O? What's the it? story of O. <laughs> the training of O. which is like it's like a erotic classic now this um you can imagine the middle-aged uh daily mail readers who are like the book quick breath meeting this and it was the orange book club as well so it was sort of like it's very very corporate and uh, i was so embarrassed so they, they obviously weren't expecting bondage and sadomasochism at a very very bad no. level well, i think they enjoyed it didn't they They did yeah they started they read all three yeah, good. <laughs> probably spiced their lives up a bit yeah <laughs> so, so, i was so embarrassed i was so embarrassed uh, anyway that is the story of um my my story of Sleeping Beauty, which ties in nicely with the Sleeping Beauty here. Um, I think that's going to be it for this week, I think, because. Uh, but what? But I have to say, once once they've all been read, mm. we'll be sure to review them. Oh, uh, you're going to a you're, bit more in depth. Oh yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, what review them on here, or review them in the bedroom? Both, I think. Probably both. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. both but the bedroom <laughs> first, and then on here. So yeah. Right. So um, uh, yeah. Well, anyway so um so yes that's it so this week uh we are back out on the trail though don't we have done a couple of um, things we went to uh went, went to that place what was that place brooklyn's motor museum, brooklyn's motor museum. Yeah. yeah i'm not sure if she really enjoyed it too much I, so I think it. she was putting on a brave face oh really yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah of course yeah <laughs> Um, yeah, went there. It we was a the, baking hot day. It though, was very and hot. The sun yeah. was really strong. I had I had no um, I had no sunscreen yeah. on, did I? No. I had to stay in the shade. That was my excuse anyway. Um, and then. <laughs> but no, it was a good day. It was a good day. And then we went to see Wolverine, didn't we, in the evening? Yeah, we saw Wolverine, yeah. and I fell asleep. Didn't That's I? right. Yeah. And then um, again, we, okay, okay. <laughs> Never have I fallen asleep watching a film. We were going to see Drag Me to Hell last night, weren't yeah. we? But, uh, but I didn't want to see that really. But I conveniently, know. we were going to see it. But then we went up into my at, parents' loft at midnight. Yeah. So she could have happily fallen asleep. Well, if you want, we can get the show in tonight if you want to see it. Okay. Um, but uh, we did get. We got. Uh, I've been watching Hannah Montana downstairs, which we, that's really really good. So um, yeah, we got a bit of a, a dodgy copy of that, but it's. Uh, it's, it's all right, isn't it? It's okay, actually, yeah. <laughs> Apart from the, the guy better. walking up, getting up to go well, to the, the toilet. <laughs> the quality is better than Terminator Salvation, shall we say. So. Well, not that we, not that we, not that we can tell. <laughs> <laughs> Buying illegal DVDs off of people. <laughs> it is just, In car parks, no, no, no not, not at all. At all no. Not at all. We don't, we don't agree with any of that. It's just it happened to, to be today, and yeah. I was, and I have, we haven't got any children to go and see, take to see Hannah Montana. So, um, Anyway, I'm going to have to go because time's ticking on now. And uh, we'll see you next uh, next time. This week, quickly, we are going to the Drab Drink on Thursday. Thursday. Where is it? It's at the Lounge 34 Bar in Lower Marsh, Waterloo. Right, well, so it, we went before. I'll put it on the blog. So. It usually kicks off around 5-ish and people turn up 
as the night goes on and it finishes at closing time which is 11.30ish there you so go. if you fancy coming so in. if you fancy coming there let's make a date to it bye